Hi, I'm Kareen and I'm a former teacher here on Twinkle. Today, we're going to talk about what the next generation science standards are, why they were introduced, how to navigate the standards, and why they are important. What are next generation science standards? The NGSS, short for Next Generation Science Standards, are a set of K-12 science standards that detail what children should know and do by the end of each grade level. These standards are designed to raise learning outcomes among K-12 students, create a set of science education standards with national and global recognition, and prepare students for roles in the rapidly growing science and technology sector. Why were the Next Generation Science Standards introduced? In 2013, a group of 26 states worked alongside the National Science Teachers Association, the American Association for the Advancement of Science, and the National Research Council to improve science education for all students. The standards have undergone numerous state reviews, but in April of 2013, the NGSS were released for states to consider adoption. Which states use the Next Generation Science Standards? Currently, 20 states and the District of Columbia use Next Generation Science Standards in their public school. These include Washington, Iowa, Vermont, Rhode Island, Oregon, New Mexico, New Jersey, New Hampshire, Nevada, Michigan, Maryland, Maine, Kentucky, Kansas, Illinois, Hawaii, Delaware, Connecticut, California, and Arkansas. Why are the Next Generation Standards important? The Next Generation Science Standards give teachers the opportunity to stimulate students' interest in science and prepare them for college, careers, and citizenship. To navigate the standards, first we're going to head to the Next Generation Science Standards website, which is nextgenscience.org. Once we're here, I think it's best if we start by grade level. So we're going to hover over the standards, read the standards. And just out of convenience, we're going to focus on kindergarten. But if you want grades K through 12, you can just hover over the grade section and it'll be down below. And let's go to the from molecules to organisms. Now here you're going to see the statement. This is the performance expectation, which is Use observations to describe patterns of what plants and animals, including humans, need to survive. So this is a statement of what students should actually be able to do after instruction, but the best way to help students meet this statement is actually left to states, districts, and teachers. Um, but under here, you'll see that there are three foundation boxes, science and engineering practices, disciplinary core ideas, and cross-cutting concepts. So this is just going to give us a better understanding of what the performance expectation is. For a brief overview of all the standards, we're going to scroll back up and return to the standards and click read the standards. And to get the brief overview, we're going to go to standards by DCI, which stands for disciplinary core ideas. Once you're here, you're going to get a better understanding of the complex ideas that can be taught over multiple grade levels. So for elementary, get K through 5, middle school, and then for high school, it's no longer by grade level, but it also does physical science, life science, earth and space sciences, and engineering, so on. Here at Twinkle, we have an extensive range of next generation science standards resources for you to use both in your lessons and as homework assignments, and some of them can even be downloaded and completed on a digital device. Check the description for details. Happy learning!